For following the money, changes could be coming to Oregon's bottle bill. Now, for decades, the recycling program has led the nation, but now the state has seen a decrease in bottle collectors. But that could lead to more money for those who do collect. Chris Holmstrom has more. Welcome to the bottle drop in North Portland. It's a monthly tradition for the Hughes family. I'm doing this to help Grandpa. He has a lot of cans today. Each container loaded one by one, five cents for each item. We have like four families, my kids, that save them so that we get to come and do this. I learned Oregon was the first state in the nation to require deposits on cans and bottles. And currently, our recycling rate doubles the national average. We have a lot of people that pick them up and it helps to make a living. And it just makes uh, the state look better. Recycling containers has been a family tradition since the early 70s. People coming in, getting five cents a container. Well, I found out that number could be doubling. Basically, over the years, the nickel has become worth less and less, you know, due to inflation. Sherilyn Burches is the outreach manager for the Oregon Beverage Recycling Cooperative. She says redemption rates have been down, and if current trends continue, those changes will come. If the redemption rate is below 80% for two years in a row, with measurements starting in 2014, the deposit will go up to 10 cents. And it's looking like it could happen. Here are the facts. In 2012 and 2013, the redemption rate was in the low 70s, below the state's goal of 80%. So now they're just wanting to make sure that the bottle bill continues to work smoothly, to bring up recycling rates, and mostly to keep litter down. <laughs> but whether it's 5 cents or 10 cents, it's not stopping these kids from making some quick cash. It's a great thing and it's a great outing for me and my grandkids and then we go buy treats. Currently the OLCC is collecting data about redemption. If that number is below 80% for last year and this year, then the redemption value will go up by 2017. Reporting from North Portland, I'm Chris Holmstrom for Quint 6 News.